Hey everyone, it's Keegan. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going apartment shopping. Woo! I'm so excited to be doing this. If you guys don't know, I currently live in an apartment and we're moving next year to a different apartment. And so I was like, okay, I guess I'll redecorate. I love redecorating my spaces. I feel like it just gives like a new refresh, restart. So I thought that we would go apartment shopping. I haven't bought, that's like, no. Mm. I bought one thing for my apartment and that's about it. So I have nothing else that I want to get for the new like design that I came up with in my head. I'll do a whole video showing you guys what I want to do to decorate it. But we are going apartment shopping. I thought Home Goods would be a very good place to start. I feel like Home Goods is always the place where I end off decorating. The place that I shop for stuff last and I always end up finding things that are cuter and cheaper at home goods and I'm like why did I buy that originally but before we go to home goods I want to clean my room because it, it got a little messy just from you know existing a little time lapse for you okay now let's go shopping let me just pause the Taylor Swift we are here at Home Goods. I actually didn't realize how far Home Goods was from my apartment. We're kind of close to my parents' house, so visit my dogs maybe. Mm -hmm. I wanted to let you guys know my thought process going into Home Goods and kind of what I'm looking for. Normally, I would go into a store and I'd be like, "Oh, that's cute," and I would buy it. And then, like I said, I would find it cheaper at Home Goods or in other stores. I want to be very intentional about what I buy. I want to find good deals. I want to find things that are the most functional and efficient. I don't want to buy things and then end up not using them. That's not sustainable. Not good for the environment. Not good for my wallet. I'm kind of shopping around. I'm looking for obviously I want to buy stuff But I'm looking for some inspiration and just cutesy things and just I don't know I want to be picky and not buy the first thing that I see for everything. It's also very hot outside It's 111, which I guess that's kind of nice for Arizona. I parked in the very back of the parking lot It's gonna be a fun walk in I'm gonna be sweating. Hello home goods. How are you today? There's no more mask mandate in Arizona and I'm fully vaccinated But I never know what to do about the mask or not if I should wear it So I normally like hold it in my hand or like put it on and like like get the vibes for the store and see what everyone else is doing and then like bandwagon it you know we're going in it's hot outside okay i never know where to start in this store because it's so overwhelming but i just found something i don't know if i'm allowed to vlog in here and i just saw a worker i kind of like this i'm going for like a gold and white theme but i don't know if i'd ever use it they also have that one the amount of middle-aged moms in here is insane basket. I already have some baskets, but like you can never have enough storage, right? I definitely want new picture frames. This one gives me girl boss vibes. I found this picture frame. I also have one from here in black instead of gold, and I really like the look of them, how there's like the clearness, and then it like stands pretty well. Wait, is it broken? Oh no, it's not. It's only $8. Put that in there, because I really want one, and I feel like you can't find things like that in other places, because like I said, I have a black one from here. It took me forever to find it, and I couldn't find it in any other store, so. Ooh, jewelry stuff. I feel like this could be cute oh gold stuff these could be really cute for like my dresser or my desk not an essential but very cute i'll loop back if i keep thinking about it later i have no idea what this is but i really like it it's like a little shelf it has like a kind of like gold rainbow i don't know if the distressed wood is the vibe i'm going for i don't know what it is though like what do you hang on this is like a towel thing should we see thirteen dollars but no clue what it is I do need new bedding. My bed currently is a full and then my new bed is a queen. So I do need new bedding. I think I want something white. Oh, that's a king. That, I don't know if that's like the look I'm going for. I don't know the look I'm going for. I know I want white. Okay, that's the same bed. Mm, oh, what's this one? No, that's not that. Um, no. Ooh, more stuff. Ooh, clearance section. Low key, like sparkly Ikea vibe. I don't need any more fuzzy blankets because I have so many, but they have the best ones here. This one's literally Kate Spade for $19.99. I think I love this one. It has has like kind of a subtle no i don't think i like it it looks like a doily now that i'm looking at it closer but i love like the waffle anyone else just hear that this one the problem with me is i don't know what i want i think this in white is what i want like just some texture do you see but not too much i also feel like i really want what is this called a comforter not like a duvet cover i've come to the conclusion that i absolutely hate putting duvets into the duvet covers and it's not worth it and i'd rather just buy a comforter what is this one kind of gives me like urban outfitter vibe you know what I'm talking about? Probably way too hot in Arizona for a quilt type bedding. What is this? This is cute. No, it's not. I know that I want to get curtains and I... 
thought I would just buy some on Amazon or something, but they have some good curtains here. Like, look at this. I actually don't mind that. It's not necessarily the vibe that I thought I wanted, but look at it. You can barely see it, but it looks nice. Also, this one, is that the same exact? That's, no. I don't know if I like the squares, but I can't decide if I love it or hate it. That's my issue for the moment. Some guy's just playing the national anthem on his phone. I don't know why, but I'm in the mirror section, and I know that I want a nice, like, gold mirror. And see, this one is, like, the vibe that I want, how it's, like, golden rounded, but I want a full length one. But I'm kind of like, this is cool, but I'm like, where would I put it? Because I also think that I want to get a round golden mirror for above like my dresser or desk. And I feel like that's just not big enough, but I love it. So I'm like, it's $35, it's all hairs. I, ooh, there's some more full length mirrors over there, but that's where the national anthem guy is. I don't want to disrupt him playing the national anthem. Like that's un-American. I also want to get some new nightstands, like some white and gold. I don't think I'm seeing any that are the vibe. I went over by Mr. National Anthem and I didn't see any mirrors that I liked. I think that I might need some more lamps because the room that I'm moving into, I I think it's pretty dark so make the videos like cute and cool better lighting we'll need some lamps and pretty lamps to be exact we found the motherland of lamps that one's cool i don't know if it's i think it's too like geometric for what i want like i said i'm trying to be picky so i'm sure i can find cool lamps anywhere cool fan is turquoise like the new color of the year let's look at some throw pillows that is gonna make me happy not my vibe but cool like i love the detail and patterns Ooh. oh look their cat's kissing if i could keep a plant alive i would love that oh fake ones this is so cute with like that that's adorable i love how this has like the outlets that's so smart i kind of like this but oh it nope it's wobbly see it's not it's not structurally sound never mind here we are these are the pillows that i want to look at like the white and neutrals oh that one's cute that's a huge pillow that's like a couch pillow i'm needing like bed throw pillows i love the texture on these are these too big that's my only question i feel like these are also couch throw pillows that's kind of cute i kind of like that i don't know if it's fitting the vibe that i want but I do like it. I haven't found anything else that fits the vibe. Interesting. Kind of like flapper girl, like fringy, you know, vibes. I think I like this a lot. See, this is what's throwing me off. I don't love this, but I love everything else. I'm like, I wonder if I could literally take all of these off. Would that be like weird? How much is it? 17. I could always return it too. This is the only thing so far that I found that I really like. Imagine that. I could kind of see the vibe. This was smaller. This would be exactly what I want. Now we're looking at throw blankets. I love like the waffle texture. I guess this isn't even waffle, but it's similar. I think that I'm gonna reuse oh hedgehogs look at it cool I think I'm gonna reuse my throw blanket from last oh my gosh let me just finish that sentence I think I'm gonna reuse my throw blanket from last year this pillow I think these two together would go good I love the texture I think I like this one even more than this one but I'm afraid this one is too big is 25 too much for a pillow I feel like that's yeah. It's not off-white, it's beige, but it's a very light beige. That desk would so match the vibe, but I don't need it. This is exactly the section that I need to be in. See all the gold? Look at the draft. That's so cute. I don't know what I would do with it. It's like a balloon animal draft. People are always asking me where my makeup brush holder thing is from. This is literally it. $15 from Home Goods. They still have it. I got it so many years ago too. I survived another meeting that should have been an email. I'll put that on a Forever 21 shirt. I've actually decided to cut this video into two parts just because there's a lot of footage. So I'll be uploading a part two. That'll be my next video. I hope you guys are excited for it and want to watch it. See what I ended up getting from Home Goods. I love you guys so much. If you are not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. Yeah, I love you guys so much. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.